everybody, welcome back to the channel. Super pumped to have you here. So today we are finally kicking off our skate support series. I've been wanting to do this for a long time because a lot of people DM me on Instagram asking for help with tricks. So we're finally getting around to do this. And I wanted to make a YouTube videos out of these because sometimes people have the same problems and they can go back and look at previous ones. Or if the problem is something completely different, we can always make another skate support out of it. So how this is gonna work is um, if you're struggling with a trick, send it over to me on Instagram and I will look at it. We'll play it over here. We'll put it in slow motion. We'll talk about it and we'll do everything we can to get you landing that trick. And if somebody lands a trick from these skate support videos, I consider this whole series a win. So today we have a submission for a pop shove it. Without further ado, let's go take a look at it. All right, so these are coming in from ira.baker3412 on Instagram. And right now we're just going to look over the attempts he sent me. And I'm seeing a few things already. So the good thing is he is really going for it and he is trying to jump on the board. So there's no fear um, on landing on the board. And that's really, really good because a lot of people struggle with um, just landing on the board. So really quick, I want to freeze it on this scoop because that is a very good scoop to have. That is something you're doing very well, and you can see your catch right there. So that all looks really good. The board is going completely 180, completely symmetrical, and you are catching it, just not in the right place. So we'll show that again. And now I want to show you my attempt real quick. So the first thing I want you to really notice is how I line my feet up. So I have my back foot on the tail and my front foot on it, and then I just jump with it, and I trust that it's going to be there. So we're going to actually play this one more time just so you can get a better look at that. So I get ready, throw the board down all dramatically. Probably should have actually skipped through this part to straight to the trick, but whatever. So here it is a little bit slower. You can see where my foot is. My front foot is where I would be for an ollie and my back foot is right on the tail. Now pay attention to how high I'm actually jumping with it. I get both of my feet out of the way and I see it and I catch it with my front foot. Now we're gonna play your attempt again in slow motion and we're gonna play mine in slow motion. So right here you can see both of our scoops and our catches. And you're actually a lot closer to landing this than you think. Um, what I would recommend is bring your back foot more towards the end, like the tip of the tail, and jump a little bit higher. And I want you to keep in mind, with pop shove -its, it's all in the back foot and the scoop. And you have that scoop really well. Your front foot is just going to be there to catch it and land on it. And since you're not afraid to land on it, you can probably get this trick down, I think, in 15 minutes consistently because you are very close. You're doing everything properly and everything correctly. The only other thing I really can comment on is just take your time with it. So when you put your board down uh, after those attempts, you're going right for it again. Just give it a little bit more time to set up your feet. Make sure you have your feet exactly where you want them to be. Make sure your front foot is in that ollie position and your back foot is right on the tip of the tail and that will help you get a uh, more of a scoop and help you pop higher as well. So pretty much you're just gonna pop back just like how you have with your back foot, jump a little bit higher than you have been and that front foot is going to catch it and then you are going to land on it. And I believe in you. You are very close to doing this, and you are definitely going to get this down very shortly. And I do really hope that this skate support has helped you out.